Women, stop suffering with a man. You did not come to this world to suffer. Suffer for yourself. If you suffer for yourself, you would not have to suffer with a man, but support a man. My hello guys hello people welcome back to this youtube channel for another celebrity latest me and k and g tv where we do celebrity news and social media wahala if not the first time this way to stop for this channel please enter with your popcorn and of course grab a seat good morning good afternoon good evening anytime you say come across this video i want to thank you for all the support that they give me and if you don't you know subscribe because subscribe now so that you go become part of this family <laughs> my people without wasting time i'm going enter the matter it gets as this one they do me for body yes this one a matter for one nigerian controversial relationship expert controversial sex therapist controversial motivational speaker my people blessing ceo in fact her real name eh, na blessing okoro my people <laughs> when i know this our blessing okoro na yes some years ago she go claim property will not be her own she take the stand before somebody building it they take pictures my people not know he said that they look and with one one eye now so they can't grab and call handcuff her she can't say oh she did sorry you say that house no be her own though say she no fake it now lie she lie my people now her matter we don't bring her for yet today mm -hmm. She don't come at concert or say make women know they work out with person where no get shishi for pocket. I said if you no get money, no come woman corner. You suppose go find person where it go it poor like you now. Yes. Say if you no get money, make you go find person where you no get money. Make we stop this pity business. Say this men, men we go always they no get money, but they want to say me they are ladies we can't get money. They pity for them. They can't they give them money. Say make we stop pamu or even this matter say suffer for years, suffer for years. Let's suffer together. We go make it together. My people say make we stop eh. Say me ladies can't work their own money with the bar. Say they are not meant to suffer with a man they are meant to support a man my people i see the matter say what did they play me no fish stay with no bringer me i must bring her out my people make una watch the video but before anything make una not forget for subscribe to this channel make una not forget for like the video turn on your post notification and write for comment section eh, what you think about this video i will see you for my next video as of now i'm out one love the Koro Blessing in Kiroka, and I'm popularly known as Blessing CEO, your number one relationship therapist in Africa. I know a lot of women are already grumbling on this video, even the men right now are eyeing me, but I know you are also watching the video. Blessing, are you saying that we should not we should not support our men? Support is different from suffer. Exactly. The society have molded a lot of African women to believing that their life and their destiny is tied to a man. That's why a lot of African women will give a man the things that they cannot give themselves. You see a lot of women that suffered with men. Yes, they have any, nothing to show for it. You suffer to build a man. You don't even have a building. That's the point. You don't have to suffer with a man when you can support the man. Because if you suffer for yourself, you wouldn't have to give a man suffering. You will give him support. What is suffering in this part of the world? Suffering simply means struggling. When you are still struggling to make it in life, when you are still struggling for survival, we'll call it hustle. When you are still hustling, exactly. Listen, if you suffer with a man without suffering for yourself, that man will dump you. Now, let me tell you what happens to the common African women. Entitlement. You give all you have to a man. After giving him all you have, you start to expect him to give you back. These are the issues. How many of you women have suffered with men and you were enjoying your suffering? Mm -mm. Stop giving people, thing, people things that you don't have. Exactly. By the time you are done building somebody and you do not build anything for yourself, you start to expect the person to take care of you. And when your expectation does not come, you become bitter. A lot of women have become bitter today just because they suffered with a man. They did not suffer for themselves. Stop giving this man things that you don't have. Build yourself first so that you wouldn't even have to suffer with a man. You go there and you give him support. You give him a helping hand. You stretch your hand and pull him up. You almost not suffer together. There is no enjoyment in suffering. I still pity women of our generation because they don't learn until they are victims. That's the reason why many of you are getting yourself messed up today. Exactly. Suffering with a man is like buying a man a car when you don't have a car. Then every day you are expecting him to come and pick you to work. The day he cannot make it, you become angry. 
the day he cannot make it, you become bitter. When you can as well buy yourself a car before even buying a man a car so that when he's not able to pick you, you can drive yourself to work. That is what has happened to a lot of you women. Stop allowing the common African men compel you into suffering with them. There is no joy in suffering. Exactly. Don't suffer for any man. That suffer you want to give a man. All those endurance, if you have so much energy and so much power, build yourself. Is it a crime for you to build yourself? Is it a crime for you to own the things that you want to give to a man? You will die if you do it by, for yourself. I'm asking you. Hmm? Madam. A lot of women actually claim to suffer with men because of expectation. Yes. Because all you men that are suffering with this man, you're expecting him to marry you. Two of us. True. If he doesn't marry you or he marries you and doesn't give you the things that you built with, it becomes a problem. My point is, I did not say don't date though. I did not say don't love. I said don't suffer. Support. Switch that you're suffering for support. And you can only support a man when you suffer for yourself, when you struggle for yourself, when you hustle for yourself. Then when you meet a man that is still struggling, you can give him a helping hand. You can stretch your hand and pull him up. Not sitting down on the ground and saying, I'm suffering with my boyfriend. I suffered for 19 years and it's time for me to shake my ass on a yacht. In Dubai! In a tongue! You don't have to suffer for any man when you can suffer for yourself. So infuse that suffering in yourself if you like suffer that much. The only problem I have with a lot of women in this man wahala relationship and marriage thing is the fact that the moment you find a man, you forget yourself. It is that forgetting yourself that is the problem. You forget who you are. And that's the reason why when the man marry you, on the man date you, no matter the kind of suffering that you suffer with this man, he's still going to leave you. A lot of women who have suffered with their husbands today, side chicks that did not even know where the suffering came from, are benefiting more. Yes! Your husband is spending this money on the side chicks. Why? Because you forget to take care of yourself. My point is, learn to take care of yourself. Learn to build yourself. Stop forgetting yourself just because you have found a man. You are building a man. You don't build men. You build yourself first and support a man. You are not supposed to build a man as a woman. Your job as a woman is to offer support. Even the Bible said it. You are supposed to assist your man, not build him. Any man that cannot build himself is not a man. Dear women, you have to unlearn all those rubbish you have learned and relearn new things. Like I used to say, what worked for your mothers will not work for you because the world is evolving. Exactly. Most of you are still using the same old method. That's why you are getting the same results. When you use old method, you get old results. It was in those days that our mothers suffered with our fathers. Because by then, our mothers did not know their capability, their ability. Our mothers did not even know that they could make money. But now, we have been exposed as women to understand that we can make as much as a man can make. Why are you suffering with them when you can give them support? Suffer for yourself. Infuse all those energy in yourself. Grow yourself. Develop yourself before you start to look for a man that you want to develop or you want to suffer with. Infuse it in yourself. I love you guys. Happy suffering.